Did you know Supreme offers easy to use customizable PDF details? The customizable details are offered to provide a quick and easy means to produce Suprema details without the need for computer aided drawing software. The details are easily manipulated using Adobe Reader. Adobe Reader can be downloaded for free at get.adobe.com slash reader. Customizable PDF details are a great tool for our customers. Suprema Sales and Independent Reps can use the customized details to describe Suprema materials and systems to their customers. Architects and other design professionals can add these simple details to their design documents. Contractors can include customized details in their submittal packages. DWG files are also available for design professionals and others using a CAD program. The DWG files contain the same layering information as the PDFs. Since many of the Suprema details are customizable, remember to always refer to Suprema technical manuals and other published documents for installation instructions. The technical manuals describe the application methods required for Suprema materials. The technical manuals and other published documents are available on Suprema's website. The customizable PDF details can be downloaded from the Suprema U.S. website. Navigate to www.suprema.us, then hover over Documentation. On the right side of the pop-up window, click on the desired marketing segment under Quickly Find Drawing Details. Once you select a marketing segment, you can apply the filter shown on the left side of the window. This will narrow your selection of details. Now that you've found the detail you want, it is important to save the PDF file to your local computer before editing the detail. Do not attempt to edit the detail through your browser's PDF viewer. If you customize the detail through your browser's PDF viewer and then attempt to save the detail, you will lose your edits. Let's review how to edit a customizable roofing detail. This example demonstrates the roof assembly detail for an insulated two-ply SPS membrane. After the roof assembly detail has been downloaded to our computer, open the PDF in Adobe Reader. There is a list of layers on the left side of the window. The layers shown are simply default selections. These layers are turned on and off to customize our detail. Let's begin by turning off all layers located below the Static Contents section. At the bottom of the Layers panel, select your Deck Type. Please note, you're instructed to select one. Our deck choices are cementitious wood fiber, concrete, gypsum, lightweight concrete with form deck, steel, steel with thermal barrier, wood, and wood with thermal barrier. The next section includes options for base sheets and vapor retarders. These layers are only selected if they apply to the roofing assembly. Moving up to the insulation system section, your choices are rigid insulation and lightweight insulating concrete. If rigid insulation is chosen, you're able to add components to the insulation such as cover board, second and third layers of insulation, and or a thermal barrier. If lightweight insulating concrete is selected, you can also show a base sheet anchor sheet if desired. Next, let's choose the base ply method of application. Our choices are adhered, which includes self-adhesive, cold adhesive, and heat welded, or superfix, which is mechanically fastened. For the membrane surfacing, we can choose foil, film, or granules. The same choices are available for the flashing surfacing, foil, film, or granules. Now that we've chosen our roof assembly components, we can customize the text. The blue highlighted boxes shown are text editable form fields. We can start by deleting the text we don't need. For example, since we did not include a thermal barrier within the insulation system, we can delete that text. The other fields can be edited as needed.
If additional notes are necessary, they can be added into this form field. We can also include our project name. The title block can be turned off. For example, if a customer would like to print the detail with their company information. The default layering statement displayed at the top of the drawing may be turned off even though it will not print. This statement shown in red is there to simply remind the user that Adobe Reader is required in order to customize the layers within the detail. Now we can save the detail. Saving the detail will preserve the current state of the layers and the text that was edited. When you close the detail, you will see a save prompt reminding you to save the detail. For certain details, some layers are dependent upon previous selections. For example, the parapet wall detail for SoberSmart SBS membrane has two base flashing configuration options. The two options are with cant or without cant. If you select with cant, all options below the without cant section must be turned off. Only options below the with cant section should then be selected. Now that we've customized our details, we can prepare the details for delivery. The PDF details can be printed to a PDF. Printing to a PDF will flatten the detail. Flattening a detail will prevent any further editing. Flattening the detail also allows the detail to be opened in any PDF viewing software with any device.